and unrest on the streets of Haiti again today. Thousands across that country marching and demanding the resignation of the nation's president. Local 10's Fritz Danverville has our exclusive report from Port-au-Prince. Another massive protest has taken place in Haiti again today as part of a two-day movement to persuade President Jovenel Moïse to leave office and to make himself available to the Justice Department for his implication in the Petro-Caribe report. The president spoke yesterday during the police academy ceremony where he made it clear that he would not leave office and also denied all allegations of corruption in the mismanagement of Petro-Caribe funds. The population, however, appears unanimous in their dissatisfaction and every major city in the country is protesting and calling for the resignation of President Jovenel Moïse. So far, the demonstration has been mostly peaceful, as thousands of people marched around the National Palace seven times to emulate the historic fall of Jericho. We can't take it anymore. Our kids can't go to school. We can't go to work. We can't have anything in the country. It's time for you guys to stand up. All the Jericho in Miami, New York, all over. Y'all need to come out here and help us. We tired. There were no reports of violence today from the population or the police, but the demonstrations are expected to intensify tomorrow until they say the president resigns. We'll bring you the latest from Port-au-Prince 80. This is Fritz Denberville for Local 10 News. <coughs>